Oh, yay! Oh. Oh. It's taken us two years or more to finally find this place. And there it is. Oh. And what a just magnificent place. Beautiful. A repelling group was actually repelling down these waterfalls all the way down to Yale. And they showed this. And in the video, you couldn't see the size of it because they didn't have any lighting. That's it. That goes in maybe 15 feet, if that. The Queen Mine and the mines in this area are from, you know, about the mid 1800s uh, to late 1800s. So it's possible that these were just uh, dug by and picked. But we thought for sure this was the one. But unfortunately, it's not. We'll head down there and hopefully this is going to be and worth all the effort we put in. We are at what we hope is, you know, something that's worth exploring today. Uh, this is the one that we found on our last explore here, but we didn't bring any gear whatsoever. Just basically our, our backpacks with food and water. Uh, I did walk in maybe 20 feet. It does go left, but after I got around the corner, it was just way too dark. So we do have our lights. This one is acting weird. So let's go explore this, hopefully, old mine. And it's not just a weird cave. There's definitely quite a bit of water here. Maybe just stay there, Cheyenne. Let me just get around the corner. No point risking someone's life for nothing. I think it just pinches out. Definitely gets really narrow. Is high. It definitely gets really low. I don't want to soak the backpack here. I should be able to see. It's it deeper, that's for sure. this corner here to at least see very monkey bottom okay let's go I'm sinking like easily halfway up my shins in mud it keeps going there's a couple pieces of uh, timbers here, which could have been for bracing. It's really cold. I'm not seeing, but it could have just been all covered from. There's a lot of wood. I think that's wood, yep. I think it's going to get deeper. You sink so far in the mud, it's kind of creepy. You think you're going down. I'm about up to my waist, or sorry, up to my crotch in water. Attention, please. Low battery. Oh, that's good. 
The one thing I forgot to charge. A bit of a collapse there in the classroom. Got some rock timbers. I can't believe this is still flooded. Into the waste. The floor of the mine is definitely not as mucky. I think it pinches out right there. The fact that this timber is standing up like that. Oh, this was definitely a mine, I think. And that's the support. Very old. Look at the mineralization there. They might come up to an intersection. Yeah, timbers. That actually might be a little bit of a structure right there. It's at the point where I'm cold. That's not a big deal. Goes to the right. That's not deep. Or it makes a hard right. You see the soot. I'm going up to my knees here, mud, which is really weird. That could just be a little pocket. Oh crap! That's deep. I'm usually up to my knees in mud. It's really creepy. You can see it's right there, and I'm sinking all the way up. And it's done. This one can go. Alright. Here we go. Oh, I'm so sinking down. Yeah, these are supports. I'm not going to waste This might be it. I don't, I'm literally up to my crotch of mud. Almost like quicksand. Definitely dries out. Oh, Jesus. Okay. That's the mud. Right there. I'm sinking up to my waist in mud. Stinks like shit. for the no helmet. Sometimes you just do what you gotta do. To be honest, I didn't think you'd go this far. Are you staying there? Here's your top. That's looking out. That's so deep. 
you want to see. Oh, Jesus. Yep. You guys can't, maybe, hopefully you can see that. It collapsed. It's collapsed. Or it pinches off. That's where the water's coming in from. You can see the vein right here. You guys can see that. It definitely went in further than I thought. But yeah, it stops there and water flowing in. And then to the left there is just a little pocket.